Lisa Marie. And Rebecca. With spontaneous Sunday stamp in. With a twist and pop. Oh yes, I forgot about that. I just felt like I needed something to You say. just wanted to say it. <laughs> <laughs> I get it. I am trying. I know, I'm trying it. to get all the things. If they would quit changing what everything looked like, that would be fantastic. Makes me crazy. Just a little bit. You'll say hello as you pop on. And then <laughs> do the thing where everybody else can find us. Sprinkle the love. What are you, hee <laughs> You said pop on. Oh, <laughs> that's the theme. <laughs> There's all that. There we go. Hey, Sarah. Oh, someone needs to finish cleaning up in here. I started and then I fizzled. Does that ever happen to you? Uh, yes, but I actually did clean my office. Are you impressed? Maybe we need to come to your house. I'm going to go do oh, this. Oh, no, it's not, it's not oh, done. Oh, it's not clean. Like, I, can, I found the floor. <laughs> um, and I cleaned out a bunch of bags and everything, but it's still quite the disaster zone. Uh-oh. Why is mine not working? Darn it. Ah! All right, if you're watching it on the Stamp by the Beach, give me just a second, because it's decided that it's going to be a stinker head. Although none of you heard that because it's not working. Let's see if we'll try again. See if it'll behave this time. Spontaneous Sunday stampin'. Coming. This looks really, really hard. And pop. Please work this time. Oh, it has a countdown. I don't think I've ever seen it do that. Okay, maybe mine is back now. What happened? This is spontaneous Sunday stamping. Did you have to leave? Yeah, it said that it lost its connection and then it was just gone. Oh. Just disappeared. You've been waiting and just now got on your thing. Well, we just got here, so you're perfect we timing. We just get here, so you're doing good. Yep. You're not behind at all. I had to go and get the Simply Chamois wet but it had been dry for so long that it was like a rock so that it took a hot happens. minute and anybody that normally goes over on becca's she should be back up and running now I if you're wanting is. to you can hang out here i don't mind it says it's there now but she says it should be working i was trying to, it's not letting me oh i know it doesn't let me switch profiles anymore like you have to like yeah, click separately there now the button is showing up. oh i don't have that button Oh. Are you sure it wasn't doing crazy things again? I don't think so. I think it's okay. Hello, Chrissy. You might be I think okay. I saw Linda. Oh, and Renee. Everybody's here tonight. Just because we're doing fun things tonight. We are doing something fun tonight. We planned. It's not quite so spontaneous. We did, we did plan it. Though, hey, Laura. Though I'm going to say I don't know how to make this one, so we're going to learn together. You and I, not her and I. She yeah, already I knows did. how. She's smart. We're using okay. Cheerful Basket. Yes, and that's what we're doing in Paper Hugs this month. And tonight is the last night to sign up. Yep, tonight is it. You have to order it tomorrow. You have to sign up by tonight. And we are doing the, this card that we're about we're to show you. We don't normally show you guys what we're going to do, but this is what we're doing. But it's such a good one <clears throat> we had to share. I feel like you needed to see it to believe it. Because otherwise <laughs> it just, I don't know that it really makes sense. Right, because I mean twist and pop or pop and twist or... Do you want to show it the card? You have oh, the card. I am hoarding the card. You are. Isn't this stupid cute? Isn't it adorable? But, but, but Wait, what? But there's, there's more. more! Are you ready? I'm going to make sure it's in both cameras. I, I love this set is. too. Hold on. Mine is doing... Okay. I think they're both in there. All right. Ready, set, go. What? Do it again. <laughs> what? Isn't that just the cutest? And it's so easy. Just Laura, I thought of you. It's easy when I did this one, because Laura, Laura does stuff like this. Her brain works this way. Mine How cool not. is this? But it's I'm so super cool. excited that we're doing this tonight, so make sure you share the video, um, the live even, so that your friends can join us. I just think it's, it's super fun. It's fun. So if this is your first time hanging out with us, we do, we're typically pretty spontaneous, and the spontaneous part tonight is I don't know how to do this, so she's <laughs> teaching me. <laughs> and so, we're going to do this in our Paper Hugs. Paper Hugs is our monthly oh, class. You can't see? It's not letting me do it on oh. the keeps The video keeps jumping. It's a monthly to-go or in person. Um, but the beauty of it is, is that when you sign up for the class, you're going to get a minimum of, of $18 to $20 worth of 
current product. So like we're thinking, we were still hashing this out tonight. This big pack of paper, do you have the catalog or do right I? Here. Oh, flip it to that. No, the, oh, you can show them the big pack. I was gonna show do them. Do you see how big and it's monstrous this sheets. amazing package of paper is? Don't pull it all out, that's I'm not, mine, I'm just it? pulling it out a little bit so we can actually fan through them. It's so good. But it's like all the amazing patterns of gingham. But we're thinking a, a quarter pack is probably what everybody's gonna oh, there's get. there's stars in there. I'm not sure yet, we're still playing with it. Are those stars supposed to be in there? Yeah. Oh, okay, I didn't see those oh, earlier. Maybe not. That, oh, well, I don't think those dots. polka dots go in there either. Okay. You have my pack of paper. I do have your And pack I probably of paper. accidentally stuck the Halloween paper in there. I, I would not that. be surprised. So would don't I, pay attention to the polka I know, dots I know stars. that one's in there. Yeah. The rest are all, it's all plaids. They're all plaids. Because isn't it called cottage plaid or something? Yeah. So I mean, it's super cute. It's called gingham cottage gingham cottage gingham in case you cottage. just hopped on look at that this is the amazing card we're making isn't that just cool so this one's probably going to cost you like four dollars to mail <laughs> this is a hand deliver card which i think some of us still do that right some of us still do that yeah your pack comes on friday her what her pack she must have ordered this paper linda oh gotcha it's really good paper i had to do this i keep hitting it you do keep hitting it. Be careful, there's a blade. Ooh, here. that would hurt. That would not hey, feel stand good off on your foot. here for a second. Hold on. Oh, okay, that's better. Better? <sighs> okay. I had this cart, it was right in my gut. <laughs> <laughs> that's not fun. So, anyway, paper hugs, you get the $18 to $20 worth of current product. And it's usually samplings of things. Like we said, we're not going to send you the whole pack of paper, it's going to get just some of it and maybe some ribbon and things like that. Mm -hmm. um, anything that's not stamped that needs to be die cut, we will do for you. But if it needs to be stamped, like I can't send you a naked kitty. You would have a kitty like this. And that would just be sad. How, I mean, if you, so if you don't have the stamp set, you just need to adapt. You can just do something else. Oh yeah, because this would, you could totally put something else on yeah. it. Yeah, or you can add the stamp set when you place your um, your order for paper hugs and we give you a little discount. So it you can get free shipping. Dyes free too. shipping, is that what, or free tax? I don't, I don't know, remember something like that. that. One of the two. It's discounted either way, so super cool. All right, you ready? I'm ready if you're ready. Do you got paper? What paper are you doing? Oh, I have to decide that now? Um, yeah, because okay. I'm gonna, I mean, unless you just know you're gonna do a white card base. Yeah, I'm just gonna do white okay. because I like white. Then I'm and gonna- And this pack of paper is good with white, I think. It is, yes, they all look good on there. All right, so we need some thick white. What color were you gonna do? I was kind of thinking the yellow there, or the green. I think there is four of each, Beck. Why did you think there was only two? Because in the catalog it says two, but I could have I think that's was the one. Four. I think that one had a typo. It has a typo then. Yep, because there's four, so I think we're going to be able to make this work for what we wanted. Yeah, I think so too. I think we're good. I think I'm, I'm honestly thinking about this gray. The gray I think would be really I cute. I think it's too. cute. But then the green is really cute too. They're all so good. Oh my goodness. <laughs> All right, well, while you're working on that, I will cut our card bases because we're going to start with a regular uppy downy card fold. So that is the 11 by four and a quarter. Did you bring me? Are you going to cut both? I'll, okay. I'll go ahead and because this piece is already. Yep. All right, and we're going to score that at the five and a half like we normally would. It's making me crazy. I know, it was starting to bother me too. We really need to finish straightening this up, is what's wrong. Okay. So there are our card bases. Can I score them? Or you I did. did it. Oh, so she just did a little I did it. All right, and then the next one is gonna be a 10 by three and a half. So all of these measurements will be over on my blog yes. and it'll be free recipe card for it tomorrow. Um, after seven usually is when it posts. And so it'll be a little picture of the final card and then we'll give you the measurements and the papers that we used, things like that. All right. The basics. Then you're gonna turn it Long ways, am I, can you guys see? I'm I could see. Okay. You're gonna have to work at the top. I know, I'm gonna have to work at the top and I don't know that I know how to work at the top. Turn it around. So I'm gonna measure down here and then I'll push it up there. Cause then it's dumb. I know it's dumb. <laughs> so you're gonna score it at two and a half. Okay, I just had to make sure I was scoring. Thank you, Chrissy, place. that's what I thought. I remembered there being, she says the catalog was wrong, it was four. Yeah. It makes more sense. Two and a half, then we're gonna go to five which disappears on this side because I'm upside down because that's the only way I operate. Ugh. I don't know why you're trying to do it like that. Because it's the stupid camera. Because oh. now I'm going to be all jacked up. I can't do it. Just trust me and know that I'm measuring at five inches. And then you're going to do seven and a half. I still got to pull the stupid thing out. You really didn't have to, but it's okay. 
or if you're super smart, you turn your card around and you do two and a half again. All right, so you end up with this panel, this four panel. That's what's gonna be inside when you're Was I supposed opens. to be making one of those? Yeah, I cut your paper, you were supposed oh. to score it. I heard nothing that you said then. What was I scoring at? <laughs> two and a half. Two and a half. And is this thick white or regular? I did thick white. Two and a half, five. And a half, five, five, two and a half, five, and then seven and a half. Can I just flip it over? Yes, that's also what I said. You also and I only need two numbers, right? Yes, two and a half and five. Okay. So you should have four panels. Yep. Okay, we're going to set him aside. Okay, because now we have to make our little folding mechanism. Do I have one of those two? I'm cutting it right now. <laughs> I'm like a two-year-old. You are. Hurry up! I All want right. mine! You need an eight by three and a half. So we're going to cut this. Eight. Get rid of this arm. It's in my way. Three and a half. That's one for Thank you. Thank you. I'm using the old trimmer. This is Chuck's. All right, we're gonna keep it going uppy downy. Uppy downy. And gotcha. you're gonna put it at one and three quarters. One and three quarters. And you're gonna score. Don't cut. I almost cut. Mine. Score the whole thing. Top to the bottom. Whole thing, top to bottom. Okay. Okay. So you're basically gonna have a middle line yep. down the center. Then you're going to turn him long ways. Yep. You're going to go two and a quarter, but you're only making a little mark. You so just need just a little a tick hatch, mark. like okay. a little tick mark. And it's two and a quarter. Two and a quarter. So I'm just going to go just a little bit. Okay. Just and so I can see it. Again at five and three quarters. Okay. Just a little mark. You're going to flip your card around because now we're going to make the exact same marks yep. on the other side. So because we're, we're trying to do diagonals. Two and a quarter, right? Two and a quarter. And five, five and three quarters. Okay. okay. Now you're gonna take your paper trimmer and you're gonna line up the ones that are across from each other to make an X. And so I, I line say. this line and this line up on my track and cut. And the, this cut one, or this score? One, score, sorry. I was ready to cut it. Lighting has got this all messed up. It's hard to see. It's very hard to see. But I can do this at the top of my paper trimmer. Okay. And then you're going to turn and do the same thing with those other ones. So we're creating an X with our score lines. Ta-da! We made an X. Good it job. marks the spot. All right. Now you're going to fold. Burnish those edges. That's the right word. Burnish? Burnish. Burnish. So with a bone folder? Bone folder will do best. then that mechanism will flow nicely. It will right? work so much nicer. And I went both ways. Okay. So that kind of breaks that paper. And since we did use thick, breaks down those fibers. And then down the middle. We do not need to burnish the edge where we did the little it's ticky supposed marks. To be dead center. Yeah. Because yours is not. not. Mine is. Fold it the other way. Oh, maybe that's it. Why does that work? Because it's thick. Because it's why. thick. Okay. All right. We need this to make a little tent. Like we're going camping. Like we're going camping. So these center pieces are going to kind of go in. And if it's not going, it's because you need to go back and fold so a like little that. bit more. So we're going to make a little tent like that. And then you're just going to smush them together. To make a house. Make a house. So what? Do that again like that. Oh, this is so much easier than the other directions that I had. Okay. And then just go ahead and make these nice and tight too. Because that will make it a whole lot easier when we go to glue this later. All right. So that was the hardest part of this whole card. Now we just put paper and color and do the things. So okay. we're going to set this guy aside. The house stays right Where there. would you like to start? Oh. We need, we need we'll probably need our next layers. Mm -hmm. I think so. So let's pick. Did you steal the paper from me? I do. Did. I didn't steal it. I just moved it out of the way. That's my little boy. He's mine too. Do you need him? I'm going to do the yellow because I think... I think the yellow is going to be... I was thinking yellow and gray. gray. Nice. Okay, well then we'll probably only need one of you yeah, because we can so. share. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to do pink and gray. Do you want me to do pink? Oh, pink and gray. Here, give me the pink too. and I'll do pink and gray. That way you do yellow and gray. How about that? I mean, it's not that big a deal. I mean, it's not uncommon for us to make the exact same card. It's we not. We have two samples. Yes. In two different colors. Right. 
Because when you do paper hugs, you're picking which paper you're going to use. That's yes. the beauty of it. All right. Paper trimmer. Paper trimmer. What color are you where's gonna... that? Where's that sample again so they can see? We'll put it up yes. here. I think we got room. What card are you, or what color are you going to do your layering? I'm gonna I did do... the red on everything. We could do gray. I'm thinking the gray and the pink will be more of an accent for Yellow the inside. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. That is um, smoky slate. Yes. Thank you. That is that going to be a basic four by five and a quarter? Yes. So we only need one, right? Well, if we're doing insides. Oh, um, gotcha. We really need more than that. Four by five and a quarter. It looks like a hundred times. She made a heavy card. I'm going to weigh this puppy. <laughs> you guys guess how much this weighs, and I'm going to post how much it weighs at the end. I'll go over here and weigh it. It just didn't look good. If you didn't do all the layers and the pieces, it just didn't look right. I mean, it looked good, but it just wasn't as it's good. It's just not, it's not the same. So you need one, two, you need three. Right. Okay. And then the next layer, I did an eighth, but you can do a quarter if that makes your brain happy. I think I'm going to do a quarter just because when we go to cut for this class, <laughs> it's going to be so much easier. So five by three and three quarters. Yep. And then you can do... I'm gonna How many of these do you need? One for me and one for you? Oh, I see. Um, or yeah. do you want a different color? You want your yellow on the outside? Your yellow would be I think I want outside yellow too. on the outside. Okay. So just, yeah, just cut me one or two or whatever. Okay. I can always go back and cut more. Yes. And then you need your little layering pieces for in here. Okay. And these are five ounces. That's a good guess. Four ounces. I think these are two and a half by three and a half. Yes, they're two and a half by three and a half. I just know it's going to cost more than a dang postage stamp. I'm just saying. <laughs> Are you weighing it now? Yeah. There's some, there's, I didn't even embellish as much as I normally would. Oh, I won't even weigh it. Jerk. There it is. Nope. I have to get my other scale, I guess. It's crazy. It won't end it. So I'm going to cut these layering pieces at two and a quarter by three and a quarter. And I'll need four of them. Did. Yeah, I wouldn't read it. Um, how rude. Okay, so what are we at? Two. Are those for me or you? Three. I can catch <laughs> some. These are two and a quarter by three and a quarter. And they're going to be your inside panels. Oh, gotcha. Because you want to glue all your panels on before you try to uh, build. To build your card. You need to build everything first. I need a pink one for the inside. Is this a blushing bride? I think so. I think so too. So you guys, we came to watch us cut paper just for the first few minutes. Because if we do this ahead of time, then you guys miss out on all of this. And you, you're like, how do you do that? Where did you get that from? How do we do it again? And what size is this again? Two and a quarter by three and a quarter. So two by three two for by the three. layer. Shoe. And I think I want some of that gray. Because I think I'll alternate. How much do you want? Here you go. Thank you. I need I need two, please. I need two, two. I do, because I wanted to alternate also. Yeah. I just feel like it breaks it up a little bit. Well, yeah. Oh, this card. I'm going to put myself on it. Please don't. I'm going to go flying. That should be three. Great sky well. diving. Okay. Rocky Mountain climbing. You know I, wasn't, I was trying to count and do math in my head. I couldn't do it. 2.2 .2 seconds? Is that how it goes? Something like that. On a bull named Fu Manchu or something? 
no idea. You're welcome. Thank you. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna start piecing some of this together so I can see where I'm at. Yep. I can always come back and cut some more. I'm gonna pray that one of these blue sticks works. That's what I'm going with. All right, so I'm gonna take this one and this one. You know, Oops. Stamp and seal plus on here. Um, no, of course not. I'm out. You probably got the one that works. I know it's a hard decision. I, they just need you to poke it. 2.7 seconds. Thank you, Susan. I was after I said it, I was like, I know 2.2 is not right. I watched a TikTok last night, and for the life of me, I cannot remember the artist's name. But like, it was one of those where they're going through the work office, and they're asking people, so. What did she look like, the girl he was bidding on? I'm trying to remember the rest of that song. Oh, shoot. I, now I'm just, yep, Fu, no Fu Manchu, yes. On a bull named Fu Manchu. Susan would yes. know that. <laughs> um, <laughs> I knew my country girls without would know it. <laughs> it's such a good song. Did you get yours to work? Finally, yes. I had to squeeze oh, let the me heck use out yours. of it. Because I'm fighting over here, a losing battle. These are my four panels for the inside. She's an eight, she's a nine, she's a ten, I know. What does she look like? So what's her description? That's the one. Does Tim Tim Graw sing that? Oh, he sings that one, yes. I'm on I'm already moved on to another song. So she's an eight, she's a nine, she's an eight, she's a nine, she's a ten on and then so what is it? He's about to kiss his heart goodbye, though. Yep, 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 <laughs> yep. Good job, my girl. See, you do know country music. Ruby red lips. What color hair? And what color eyes? Blonde hair, blue eyes. <laughs> oh, which one do I like? I think I like that one. But I also Good job. Like that one. Which, which Are one? Are these mine? Which one? Which one? Which one? Oh, oh. Can we, why can't you use it all? John Michael Montgomery. Thank you. Did your brain just know that, or did you Google? There's no, like, that's not bad if you Googled. I'm just curious. <laughs> oh, that big old plaid. I like it, though. Is it going to get covered? No. These these are on these little panels. One, two, three, four. <gasps> I didn't do my other. I only did my front piece. I need a pink one. You need pink. These are blushing bride. Mm -hmm. I'm probably going to stick with. I'm going to do these the other side. I like, I, oh, man. If I'm gonna stick, I also like this one. If I'm gonna stick words, maybe. Oh, ah, I knew it. I love ah. his music, and that's one of my faves. I love that song. Nobody's on my page answering me. So. I can remember the kids would sing it when they were little, cause you know, you know how it is in the car. They learn all the words. Mambo goodbye, number not five. Goodbye. Remember when Nathan used to crank out Mambo number five? Mambo number five, the worst song on the planet for my <laughs> kid to be singing, and that's the one he knew the words to. Every single word. But you knew um, whose boots are <laughs> under their bed, Shania. Oh, I don't remember that one. Yes, you did that one, and you did another one, a breakup song. It was one, um, but you did all of it. Now I can't think of it. <laughs> it was funny. Funny stuff. Go ahead and glue these in too. So you guys tell us what is a song that your kids knew that maybe they you're not so known. proud about them knowing now. <laughs> now that you know the words. This little light of mine doesn't count because that's a good song. <laughs> <laughs> I'm very hot. Just I'm in getting case a little warm. Anybody if was you would wondering. Like to turn something up, you could. Holy cow! Mine's mine like Smash Mouth. Nikki by Prince. <laughs> I am gonna have to turn the fan off. It's fine. Ooh. I think you have to turn it off to make it come back, right? Probably. Oh. Here it goes. Ah. <sighs> Oh, he didn't realize you'd put prints on his iPod. <laughs> I have those cute little panels. Hey, where's that piece at that I'm supposed to be doing? That's not it. Here it is. Which way do they have to fold? Like a zigzag? They're gonna be, but you need to be able to go like this. Uh -huh. If that helps you at all. See how they're a little bit crooked? So you have to be able to go like that. No, mine How did I get yours? 
Because you just need to fold it the other direction. After my parents had their 50th, my kid went to preschool singing, drinking rum and coke. <laughs> <laughs> do you have my white card base? You yes. do have two. You stole mine. I didn't steal it. I was keeping it safe. Yeah. We'll go with that. How cute is this? At one point in time, my brother would sing Friends in Low Places on the way to church. <laughs> <laughs> There's that. I used the decal. Oh, what else? Doodads. Welcome to burlesque. <laughs> you used what doodads? Do you wish for the deckled as well? Or do you, you want to probably should. Edge? You're going to have to go out over here and find them. You took them. I did not take all of them. You kept them. You only gave me one Where did set. I put them? I Are they not. back in the bucket behind us? I don't, I don't know. We'll just take a quick peek and I'll take a quick peek as soon as I'm done. Here, do this. Do this and I'll do it. That's probably a better idea. I can glue. We all know you don't want to look. I just don't always know how your brain works when I go to look. They're right things. here. See, you knew where they were. To be fair, he was five at the time. <laughs> Cuteness. It is. Here you go. Okay. Oh, I'm super excited about this. Do I, I probably need to burnish these? No. You need to go like you this, really want to. They need them to go like that. I feel like they're overlapping just a smidge. You can cut them. That's not the right one. Do, is it going to be bad if they're overlapping? I don't think so. You should be fine. Okay. All right. That's the white one. White. And then this will be our gray. Yeah. So you could take one of your inside now, pieces and cut out the middle. Nathan was in preschool for 9-11. Yes. So God bless the USA, that yep, child. Oh. And I set my heart on fire. <gasps> Except he would sing it out of context and not yes. the whole thing. So yes. he'd be going through school, set my heart on fire. <laughs> Didn't you get a call about that one? <laughs> well, he also wanted, he, he wanted to die because what he was saying was is he couldn't wait to get, a, get to heaven. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that was great. Do I get one too? Yes. Oh, I just took one of my inside pieces because we're going to put white over that to go on the okay, inside. Okay, I'll give it back to you in a minute. Yeah, this one's mine. Do I want gray or do I want pink? I want gray. I want gray. I wanted all my layers to be. Pink. And then what? Do we need a white one now? Yeah. This guy. Okay. This guy needs to be white. I was verifying. You might have these in your box of magic, but we'd have to dig through and find the right size. I spilled the box. Well, then, probably not so, a good, good plan. Let's not talk about that. Larry's okay. here. <laughs> He's listening. This is backwards. That's what's wrong. So I see when it's so trashy. All right, while you do that, I'm going to yep, start coloring. Yep, you go ahead, I'll be fine. stick. Cool. There's scrap, there's a pad of scrap paper over to your right behind that cardboard. Why do you keep sticking your hand in the way? I was trying to get all my things. Thank Come you. on, sister. Okay, so that's going to go on the front like that, but I'm going to set this aside, and we're going to color. Did you get me a white piece? I What white piece? So that I can color. I this one was had of them over oh, there just, on the other side of the cardboard. I didn't hear. No, there's not. There was. There's not. Well, there was. But I'm telling you, there's not. <laughs> it's okay. I'll get some. You just color. What colors do you want? I already got the colors. They're in my box. Oh, so good. That we wouldn't have to think. Oh, that's a good thing. Where's the dyes? Um, over here. Okay. Let me clean up this mess a little bit. And then, if by chance you cut your basket crooked, just Trim it up. Because <laughs> I don't like all that extra white. Oh, gonna... but mine came out perfect. I know, I left you the perfect one. That was really nice of you. I know. Oh, look, we got 12 people back again over here. I think all your people are over here. I think, I don't know. Mine, I have a feeling yours isn't working. I have working. a feeling mine isn't working either. So I kind of gave all up. Right, so what are we doing? All right, these are for apples. Oh, yes, I have to color apples. I have to color apples. I did the leaves with the granny apple yep. greens, and I did the apple with the parakeet party with a little bit of the light granny over the top. I think I, I understand. Show you how to color. No, I know how to color. I'm just gonna color my apples the way I want to color my apples. There you go. You don't have to color your apples like my apples. I do not have to color my, my apples, apples the way that you colored your apples. 
There's an Alex hair. That's a bonus. Yeah. Am I even on camera? Probably not. You need to move. I probably need to come over because I don't know if I might go this way with that. Stand him up though so I can remember what you did. Cute. I don't know that I'm a fan of the orange apple. You don't have to be a fan of the orange apple. He got a little bit oranger than he I wanted He did get a little be. orange. I think it's the way the light's hitting it too. That's probably very true. Tick, it has told me your video had ended, but it hadn't. Had to refresh. Yes. Gotta love the book. I'm gonna have the green. You took the green over there. You took all the stuff. Sorry. If you don't want to share, I understand. <laughs> if you don't want to share with me. I'm just not always the best sharer. I'm sorry. You, she wasn't, I mean, you weren't like an only, only child. They did home daycare. You'd think you would. I'm oversharing. You're overshared. Is that what it is? I don't like it. <laughs> she did have to share everything. Her toys became the daycare toys. Poor mistreated baby. It was. So that was the dark real red. And then I'm going to go back with the. I think this is light cherry cobbler. Light cherry cobbler. Cute. For those little lines. I'm thinking, I'm thinking, I'm thinking. I'm just gonna do red and green. I might just do a yellow apple instead of trying to add orange into him. Is that what happened? Yeah. He's not bad. I just, I don't think that I've seen an orange one. I was trying to get like a pink lady. Oh uh, yeah, okay, I could see that. And it didn't quite happen. Didn't work out. Oh, I can't get these markers open. Oh, 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 I just broke that one. You just broke when I think that one does it all the time. Okay. You're good. You're good. I can't get it off. I can't use the other end. Your other end is smashed. Yep, that was Katie Manor. Oh. Gotta love those little old ladies. <laughs> Hope they don't watch. They don't. Can you uncap it for me? Which one? This one. Just gotta kind of wiggle it a little. I did, and the whole thing came off. See? You broke it. Just use your teeth. I tried. It's broke. It's time for a new cherry. Here, we'll use mine. So I just put a little. Did I use the wrong one at that? No, I didn't. Did you get it? Yeah. You're so much better than me. I really like cherry cobbler for my apples. It's really pretty. And I know my big old hand's probably in the way, but that's because we die cut them before we colored them so that you didn't have to watch us die cut all night long. Oops, a bit the blends are nice because you don't have to blend colors. You can just use them the way they are. Stress free. I meant to grab the light, not the dark, but that's okay. <laughs> oh, how did I manage to do that? I did one, two, three green. I'm a ding dong. <laughs> I have all okay. three of my green are together too. If that makes you feel any better. I don't know why I didn't want them together, but. Because it's going on the yellow. Oh no, it looks good. So it's going to be okay. It looks good. This one's mine. Alright, so now we're doing our cat and our basket. This is so soothing. It is. I was thinking, I, I bet they're bored out of their minds watching us color. So I'm really glad to hear that. <laughs> what, what color did you color the cat? Brown? Yeah, he was a brown cat. I want him to be orange, I think. I think I want a gray cat this time. Oh, that would be nice too, but I think the orange will pop. Pop. I'm just not good at coloring orange cats. No? Mm -mm. They end up getting too orangey. I'm going to try. I mean, we'll see. Oof. I'm really struggling with the blends tonight. I can't get them open. There's that color. 
And then this is, oh, Pale Papaya is pretty too. So I'm scribbling them out so I can see what the colors look like before I start to color my cat and find out I don't like what I just did. <laughs> and I think I want pumpkin pie light. I think. Ooh. And we have a little orange cat. And he's a light orange. He's not that bright, deep orange. Like He's not like Garfield orange. I always feel bad because we get so quiet when we're coloring. They're probably, you know what? They're probably going to the God, thank God they shut up. <laughs> I think some of them have us on mute anyway. Oh, they're good watching point. TV shows. That's true. And like the new season's all going to be starting soon. Yep. Football. Did this football come out on Sundays? Because I don't even know. Yeah. cute. I see. What is this? Oh, it is Mango. Let's see what happens with Tango. We can get some loose stripes. I'm watching and doing a puzzle. So you're keeping busy. because I'm going to make a little handkerchief thing to stick out of the top of my basket. Does he look bad? Why would he look bad? He's a little orange. He's a little too orange? I can go over him with something and fix it. I don't want a little pink. What is this? Did you bring light crumb cake? Mm, no. Just dark? Yeah. Can't wait to try this car. We're not a football family, just NASCAR. Football is now in preseason. I knew that, Larry, because you posted that the other day, and I was like, oh. But I don't know, like, when it comes on, when it starts. I think I like to say. I don't dislike football. It's just not at the top of my watching list. Would he be better if I went over him? Maybe. You think Maybe I don't do orange cats. I have a hard time with them. Okay. I've learned my lesson. I'm going to do a great cat. Probably smart. <laughs> <laughs> Probably got a good idea there. Though actually this is kind of working, so I'm not sad about it. Oh, well, there you go. You're fixing him. He's better. So this is ivory. The ivory marker. So I went back over, I had light, light pumpkin pie first, and then I did his little stripey guys with the dark pumpkin pie. Let it dry for a second, and then I'm going back over it with my ivory. There we go. Ta-da! Have Secrets of the Jungle on TV. I'm watching and listening while I sort out expired meds. <laughs> <laughs> you two make it more funner than usual. <laughs> I hate doing meds. Jane, will you come do ours? Oh, it's the worst. What'd you do with this old butterfly? I'll be on every day that it's on TV in our house, Thursday p.m. and then Sunday and Monday. Oh, it's on all the time. Yes. <laughs> okay, well, he's all green. He doesn't get a white tummy because I messed up. Yeah, I didn't even try to do that. <laughs> I opted not to go there. Ooh. Just coloring the little butterfly. And now I'm going to color my basket. Did you already color your basket? Yeah. What color did you do it? All the browns. All the browns. All the browns. What do we got? This is retired. Oh, I didn't even know that one was in there. It must have been why I liked it. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> That's usually what happens. You need a whole set of markers just for Katie Manor. I do. I have retired colors. I apparently do too. <laughs> I feel like they have beat them up. Some of these are really old too. 
Like, well, I'm just going to say I to don't do Katie Manor, and some of mine look like that from my classes, so. Sometimes it's just from being used. It's just getting all the love, right? Okay, I'm going to dimensional my little handkerchief that I made. When did you make that? I cut it off a piece of paper. Did you make me one? No, because I figured you'd, I don't know if you wanted pink or gray. I did yellow. You did. And then you don't have to worry about coloring your handle because your right. fabric is going to cover right. it. I heard you say that earlier. Okay. So you're sort of listening to me. I hear bits and pieces. And then we're just going to stick our apples where we think we want them. My basket is intentionally, football sounds is my favorite decor. <laughs> All right, so where's that little, where's your little triangle thing? What did you make? I just cut off a corner of a piece of paper. So I had this little strip and I just hopped okay. it off. So there is a die that does it in this set, but we already had plaid paper, so I didn't think we needed to. Oh, you just went like that, right? Yeah, you just make a triangle. I can make a triangle. You can do that. And then he's gonna go on the front of our little, are you done with these? Uh-huh. And let's move these out of the way. Oh, I didn't color my butterfly. I colored mine. I colored mine. Oh my gosh, I have all these pieces now. I have to figure out what to do. So we're gonna have this cute little guy. Did you dimensional the handkerchief thing? Oh, these are yours, not mine. Is this the hanger? Yes, I dimensioned oh, I didn't hear that part. Can I have some dimensionals? I said I'm going to dimensional this guy. I thought you had your basket in your hand. Because no. I did hear you, those words. I just thought you were doing well, something else. Oh, did, I, did you grab a smoky slate? No, I must have brought a smoky slate. You took it from my thing, I think. These have your stickers on them. Oh, and they're I only, mine. And I Why are you touching two. my stuff? <laughs> Why are you messing with my stuff? I was trying not to grab your stuff so that I wasn't just mixing. Gonna, there was a little fly bug here just a second ago. I just squished him. Good. We don't like those. Oh, do you want ribbon? And the apples, do they go up against here, right? Yeah. I just used dimensionals to hold them. Thanks for telling me that after I stuck them on. <laughs> you didn't listen to me at all. I was very much concentrating. Yes. Yeah. Okay, I was just making sure. It's not done until you add some ribbon. But I'm about to stick mine down without. <laughs> you can wrap it around the actual layer too. I want it around my basket though. Let me retype that. Football sounds are part of my fall ambiance. <laughs> Share that ribbon? Those oh, scissors are really gluey. Yeah, they are. I was using them to do that crazy twisted ribbon card the other day. Do you have blue dots in here? Um, behind us over here on the table, probably. Oh, boy. <laughs> it towards the back, probably hanging on something. Can't wait for football Saturdays. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I'll watch it, but like, I'll watch the Super Bowl. I like to watch like at the end. I'm kind of over it. There we go. Like if I have to watch it all season, I think I'd lose my mind. I'm kind of thankful. That, oh, I'm very thankful that I have a husband who's like, can live with it or doesn't matter. Take it or leave it. That's what I was trying to say. How flapping cute is that? Okay, and he's just gonna go on the front of this guy. This ribbon's a little twisty, but it's okay. We're just gonna embrace it. Okay. All right, then he goes. So cute. This one I'm gonna dimensional because you know this card isn't heavy enough. This is going on here, right? Yes. College is my favorite. War Eagles, Gold Knowles. 
do college ball. I only do college ball. Okay. I like hockey. <laughs> but don't ask me anything about it. I just like to watch. I like the fights. <laughs> what you want on your little inside pieces. Okay. So I'm now we're here. Take them off. Oh, where's my apples? Oh, my I forgot cat's we cut out we cut here. out some little apples to go in here too. Isn't he cute? Is he watching the butterfly? Yeah. Aww. Buckeye fan. See my dad's a buckeye fan too. Which makes me a buckeye fan. See? So my little kitty's gonna go there. And then he's gonna be watching. Is he going bumpy up too? Okay. Some apples. I'm gonna be really excited when this card works. I'm a Buckeye fan and I love hockey too, see? But I don't know anything, like seriously, I just like I just like it. I'm not, I don't like get all into it or anything. But I used to go to the, um, I don't know, the Chicago guys. <laughs> see, I know nothing. <laughs> Blackhawks. <laughs> And then there was a, um, a call. Is it, I feel like there was a college team, but I could be wrong in hockey. But we also, oh, wow. What are you doing? Where's your stems? I don't have any stems. Did you not cut two things of stems? Yes, I did. They were all here. There's one. The fan probably got them. Oh, no. I'm short one. That stinks. Oh, I know, that's the one. Okay. Your apple rolled away. He already ate the stem. <laughs> that's what right my there. cat would have done. Your cat, yes. You got the bad cat. I'm going to put my butterfly over here. That way it's not so lonely. Oh, curling is cool. All right, do you have the stamps? Or do I have the stamps? I have think you do. I'm just gonna do the you fill my day with happiness. Because I think that one's cute. Come on, glue. Where did you put all the blocks that I brought in? They're behind me on the cart. I told you they were like making me crazy. They were like all up in my way. Would you like the same words? Yep. Whatever you were handing out, I'm taking it. Oh, I thought I glued that to my finger. I don't know that an apple is going by my cat. I think since I'm missing, <laughs> we'll put it behind it. Maybe you won't notice. And then when I find it, I can stick it on there. And that's what I'll do. Let's go over here, back where it was. Bloop, you get to pick. And then he's just gonna sit there like that. Did you take my little half dimensional? I did. He was there for a reason, man. He fit on my apple or my I... butterfly. <laughs> That's what I did with him too. That stem will turn up when we're all done. I didn't really like this gingham paper, but now I'm seeing it and being it used the way you're all using. I'm changing my mind, yay! I like when we change your mind. That means we have our right, job well done. <laughs> Because some things just need to be demonstrated. They really do. Sometimes you just don't know. There's lots of things until I get them in my hands that I have no idea that I'm going to like it. I'm a huge fan of gingham paper, so it was already sold for me. But I can totally understand. Look at how cute that is. The gray is super, super cute. It is. I like your shadow under your basket. I don't like when my baskets float. <laughs> I you? have floating baskets. You have a floating basket. I can add a little shadow to mine. I really wish I knew where my stem was. You probably got stuck to something. Oh, no doubt. There we go. You fill my day with happiness. Oh, did you cut mine out too? You want me to cut out? Which one did you like better? Um, whichever one looks the best. I don't care. This one on the they left look, looks pretty good. They look pretty much the same, I think. I'll take it. Sold. She's an eight, she's a nine, she's a ten, I know. <laughs> Do you have some white layers that we can stick on the inside? Yes. So we don't have to use more Yes. DSP, or at least not a whole sheet? Yes. Because we're not going to see all that. Mm 
Yes, yes, yes. You want white, right? Yes, please. Is it going to work? It's gonna work. It looks better in small pieces. I think it looks even good in this. You know, this is this size small, right? And then even smaller. I will agree. Some things you need in small doses. What are you doing over there? I like mine to fade out. Oh. Well, let me try and fade mine out. Cause now I'm feeling like all not Cause faded. then it's not so dark. I just want it right here. I don't mind it dark around the sides a little bit. That was a good idea. Thank you. Ow. Sorry. I my hand. wasn't trying to hurt you. Cry baby. <laughs> All right. This guy, we're going to just. I'm gonna Where does do this it. go? Well, I just put him on my work. He's too big. No, is he's he? not. Oh, he just makes it. He just makes it. As long as you can close your doodads like that, then you're good. But he just fits on there. Okay. And then this front panel piece can just be flat because he's already a big card. My heart says dimensional it, but I did do mine flat <laughs> because I was like, there's a lot of dimension on here. That yellow is really good too. It is. Okay. Okay. Now what? Um, dun, dun, dun. If we're going to do anything on the inside. Oh, we have to we do need, that we now. We need to do that now. Well, remember we had these guys still, right? So the ones that we cut our things out of. Oh, that's right. And you Here's can one. do a whole piece up at the top is probably what I'll do. Yep. And then just do a white piece. You could just leave it white down at the bottom and maybe just put a strip. Yes. That's and then, what I think. Ha, then we cut down on the paper. Yep. It'll make it a little bit lighter too. Why are you cutting? I didn't oh, cut you didn't have a yellow? I, didn't, I only cut a little bit. And then I'll have a little piece to go. Oh, I think I'm just going to do mine gray. But I guess I could do it pink, though. Well, you guys, oh, I don't <laughs> mind that. That's kind of cute. That's really cute. Oh. I like this idea. I think we're going to go that way because then it's going to coordinate with that. That's what we're doing. So, again, if you want to do this card, Paper Hugs is your friend this month. You need to sign up tonight. With that glue. Is it this one? Yes. You sure? Oh no, it's that one. <laughs> Maybe if I put the lids back on them when I'm done, they would all work. Probably would hope. I probably would. Oh my gosh, this is gonna be so cute. And you could totally do another layer here, and it's you could. Super it's super cute. I mean, I did it on the other cut one, but it cuts down on. But it's a lot of weight. So much since we're. Just sticking white on there any anyway, or we're going to? Because you could do, just like you said, just a little strip down here. Yeah, I grabbed a little strip to... That could be cute. Oh my goodness, did you two actually cut out the center to save cardstock? Well, I yes, did. we did. We learned I from did. our friend. <laughs> I am. I'm just going to stick a little piece down here, because that's really all you're going to see, because this is going to come across yes. your middle. So this would be where you sign, where you can write something. You could put a little label there if you want it. You could put like, a little label. I brought these guys over. Just stick that in my glue. Sorry. <laughs> it really wasn't intentional. I'm what is that? Four and a quarter. Stick a little piece of And I don't want it that long. I want it more like that. Da -da -da. Okay. Glue, please. Glue, please. We're gonna need seal or tear and tape. Um, tear and tape's in the drawer usually. On the far left, I believe, is where I saw it the other day. I'm very proud of me right now. <laughs> They're both ones from Paper Pumpkin. Yeah. Okay, get this out of the way or does this stay? Just keep them out of the way. Right now, we just need to focus on our tent. Our tent? Our little house. Okay, we're back to this. Can you explain Paper Hugs again, please? Yes. It is a monthly class. You can subscribe to it so that it's automatic, or you can choose to sign up every month when we post the registration. And you have to you have to sign up by the 10th, but when the 10th lands at the end of the week like it did, 
we go ahead and hold it until Sunday night for Spontaneous Sunday. <clears throat> so tonight is the last night. It's $35, and that's shipped to you, or you can come to class in person and do it. And I do, we do a daytime class. I do a daytime class, and we both do evening classes. But you get a minimum of $18, usually way more than that, oh, because, well, well, that's how we roll. It's current product, plus your card kits. Here you go. Now what do we do? What else? Oh, so usually it's like paper embellishment and ribbon, um, and we change it up. It just depends on how you know how much it is in product that we have. Oh, I need another one. You need to do the whole triangle. I wasn't sure. I was waiting to see what you did. We're only putting glue on our triangle piece. Is that enough? Yeah. Okay. Should peel only that? this triangle, not this one. Just one at a time. Yes, ma'am. Then there's no confusion. If you subscribe, and you have to subscribe for six months in a row, then you're gonna get a $25 gift from us with current product. I'm sorry, I got a bad spot right here that doesn't wanna come off. Oh, there it is. All right, we Ooh. don't have any upside down houses. So your house is gonna be upright. Triangle's gonna go up to the top, but not to the crack. Give so, yourself about an eighth of an inch and you wanna go as centered as possible. Okay. If you don't, it's okay. We can fix it. We How does that push look? down? Is he over enough? Yeah, I think you're good. I don't know. I feel like I should have marked the center. It's okay. Okay. Because this guy's gonna go on, and you're okay. not gonna be able to tell. So we're gonna do this again. We're gonna do it again on okay. the triangle that is now facing us. All three. All three. Thank you. You're a good teacher. I bet we're gonna shut the door on you this one. You are gonna shut the door on this one. That's the best way. Shut the front door. When I worked in middle school as a reading coach, the kids would do that. They'd walk in the classroom and go, shut the front door, so that you'd think they said something potty. <laughs> middle schoolers. <clears throat> so you're gonna make sure that guy's laying flat. You're gonna close the door, give him a good smush. But be gentle smush. to your apples. And he should. Never squish the bloop, apples. Bloop, bloop, bloop. Like that. Look at that. You're going to let him lay open. Is that open? He doesn't go Yeah, flat. he's not going to go flat, and that's okay. You okay. don't really want him to go flat. You oh, just okay. need him to kind of cooperate Yours was, you. like, going flat. It did. You're going to take your thing. You're going to close your books. Close the books. Okay. You're going to line this up where you want it. I like to open the books once it's on here so that you can make sure that you're, you're covering up this folding oh, mechanism yes. straight. Okay. And then if you didn't put it on straight, you can adjust it at this point. Well, I don't know if I did or not. It doesn't matter. Okay. But you put it where your, your heart is happy. Oh, I hope this works. Close your doors. <laughs> yes. Oh, I had stamp and seal. It was so much easier. I didn't have to keep putting stuff down. I'm so sorry. I'm out of stamp and seal and I will order some. Okay. So let me do this one more time. <clears throat> oh, nope. That's not level. There we go. That makes my brain happy. Down. Down just a little bit. Sometimes <laughs> She's talking to herself. You gotta talk to it. Okay. You're only doing it in this top rectangle. Just two pieces? Two's good. Okay. I need to bring this closer to my face, guys, so hang on. If you have stamp and seal, you can like do the whole shebang, but I think we're running low on tape and I was trying not to. So just fill the square? Fill your top rectangle, yes. A good friend would have done that for me. I'm still holding mine down. Oh, sorry. This is easier with the seal because you can do it one-handed. You don't really have to have two oh, hands. It's stuck to me. I'm probably not on camera again. Sorry, okay. guys. I think you're okay. And you're going to open your book and push it down. Okay. I'm, you, are, you do realize you are dead center in the table again. You do realize that. No? Yes. Oh, you were right here. <laughs> I'm over here on the end. I'm sorry. Okay. Close your book. Just the one. Just this guy. Yep. Open him, you mean. Open your book, sorry. Give him a good push. All right, we did the top here, so, so we're gonna do, do the, the bottom, bottom here. here. I knew that. <laughs> Could I do it the other way? Oh, then it would make it open a different you, way. You can flip flop it. As long as you do one top and one bottom, you're okay. You can't do two tops or two bottoms. 
and you don't want to do both of them. I got too much. I got sassy over here. Same thing, right? Yep, same thing. You guys need to run and get six more friends and I'll give away a stamp set because we have 14 people watching tonight. Okay, is this like the the test? It's gonna feel weird the first couple times because you gotta break it in. <laughs> but it worked. I know. <laughs> okay, you guys. And then you just it's you close so and you have cute. to guide it that first time. The first few times, Oops. I think. And like my tape didn't stick all you the way. You probably didn't push. I probably didn't push hard enough. <sighs> but now. Oh my gosh, that is so. Flipping if he's cute. not staying, stick your bone folder in there on that triangle and really mush him down. Because that's probably where it's not sticking. I was just going to say, that's probably exactly where it's at. And then just give him a good smush. All right. It's nothing a good smush can't fix. There we go. How cute is that? And that was easy. It was just steps to put papers on here. It was really... This, okay... My team members that are on right now, this is not a regular card class. No. This is a specialty class, like a fun folds class, where you're only going to do a couple, like one like this, and the other three phone folds would be much easier. Um, or maybe you would do two of these so that they would really want to count my parents who keep checking the screen. <laughs> i got to go by the numbers on the screen. <laughs> It's so cute. I just need a little, we need a little embellishment, right? The little black dots. I used these guys. I love those guys. Mm -hmm. There's even gray ones in here. I was just thinking that. And he just needs, like, you don't even need that many. Oh, well, now Two. I don't know where I want them. You put them up here, but I think I want them up here. And you can put them inside, but I like them on the front. There we go. <gasps> So good. I think I need to make my apples sparkly though. Because <laughs> I mean, come on. At least the little shadow lines. Are you reading? Cute. Ah! I like the pink and gray. And look at you can do the whole apple in here. Cute. It'll be sparkly. I think this one would be a fun one to do, like, pictures of, like, kids. You're going to send it to a yes. Because you could put pictures in here. You could put a little saying. The granddaddy of all fun folds. Oh, there's bigger and badder ones out there, Jane, but we do appreciate that compliment. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't it super cute? We will definitely have the measurements, um, and you guys can always go back. We'll have the video will be over on YouTube tomorrow. So you'll be able to go back and watch us do it um, if I get some or free you time. Can just come to Paper Hugs and we'll help you do it. I was thinking that too. If you just come to Paper Hugs, then we're going to show you how to do it. We're going to walk you through it because it is, you know, it wasn't hard. You just it's have to steps. really follow the steps. Thank you guys so much for the hearts. Facebook loves that, but I love it more. <laughs> I put a little I just scallopy wanna, dude I just down there. Sit and open it. Do you want one? No. Okay. You don't like my scallopy dude. I thought well, he was cute. I feel like this one I could almost get away with. Almost masculine. Almost. I was thinking about sending it to my dad, so. <laughs> I think your dad would like it. <laughs> After class. All right, you guys. So we are at August 14th, which means we are halfway through the month, and celebration is almost over. That's so sad. And we won't have any more again until January. Uh -huh. I know. So make sure you get your orders in for that. Make sure you get signed up for Paper Hugs. We're going to post the link when we're done. Um, make sure you get signed up tonight if you want to join us for that. We would love to have you. Again, it's not a commitment. You don't have to do it every single month. It's just a bonus for you if you do. Um, and the reason that we do that is because that helps us with preparing. We can order. So if we see something, like something goes on sale, we can have an idea. So if we know that 10 people have already said the subscribed and we know they're mm -hmm. going to be doing it then it just really helps us helps us out more than anything so, so we're, we're not like buying to, extra or so under buying yes, or. yes so we don't have to turn people away you know but anyway that was fun this was fun see you told me you couldn't do I this i know one. i was like you did no. it on the first time i'm like no i've tried i can't tell you how many pieces of paper i wasted last year when i tried to do this oh no it was bad <laughs> like they're probably still wandering around my office That's because terrible. i threw them and because I just, the directions I had were not 
they didn't explain it the way you did. So well, good job. You go. Thank you. Good job. So you guys, thanks for hanging out with us tonight. Yes. We appreciate it a whole bunch. And we'll see you guys again next Sunday, right? Yeah, we'll be here. All right. All right. We'll see you guys right. later. Bye. Bye.